Hi everyone and welcome to a very sunny day. Spring is definitely here and summer is just around the corner as well, which is really good. It means I can get out and take plenty more photos, which I really do like doing. And talking of photos, something turned up the other day. I had lots of deliveries actually and lots of boxes to tick. I'll come on to the boxes to tick in a short while. But I actually had a delivery of a little accessory to go with my Lumia 1020, which is sitting just down here on the desk. And this is what turned up. So this is the Lumia 1020, looking very, very good, really pleased with it. And this is what turned up, which was the camera grip. And I've never sort of really used one of these for a sort of great length of time before. But basically it's got a battery built into it, so it recharges the Lumia 1020. Also got a really nice sort of grip on the end here and an actual sort of two-stage shutter button. And obviously you can see the uh, camera pointing through here. And it's got a tripod mount on it as well. So very, very handy case. Uh, I think it's run out at the moment, but this is the charging port. It's also got some battery indication on the side. Let me just hold that down. Yep, yeah, it's out of battery at the moment, so I need to get that charged. But very, very pleased with it. So uh, a great purchase. Very, very happy with uh, how that's working out. I also got the wireless uh, charging cover as well for the Lumia 1020. So I'll alternate between the two. But very happy with that. And uh, I also mentioned about ticking lots of boxes. Well, just about an hour ago, I actually agreed... Uh, on some office space so that's definitely happening now I'm actually going down to sign uh, some documents for that very very soon but it's not for Geekanoids that's all I'm gonna say at this stage it's not for Geekanoids but I'm very very happy that this other project that I'm working on is progressing really nicely now and as soon as I can I'll share some more details with you and when I'm actually in the office space, obviously, I will share that with you as well. So it's now early evening and you will not believe what has turned up in the post. I've got a big grin on my face. Now, if you've watched my videos for a while now, you know I often refer to the extending arm that I keep my camera on. Well, a new one turned up in the post. Here we go, I'm gonna show you. Are you ready? You all know I love orange, don't you? You must know by now that I love orange. Here we go, look. Wow, awesome awesome color i love it so this is from xeries i hope i'm pronouncing that right but the website address is there so it's xeries.com and this is an aluminium design extending arm or telescopic pole quick and effortless usage looks really cool look at that there's all different colors available you can get black white blue a nice bright pink color yellow orange and green and it looks really nice it's got a camera adapter it says on the back here uh, fashionable features quarter inch universal screw uh, what does this say uh, ball head and thumb screw to lock camera in desired position this looks awesome it's even got like a, a lanyard type attachment on the bottom so anyway let's get this open and have a look now I don't normally do this sort of thing within the daily videos but I just had to share this with you purely because it's orange and I love orange. How do I get into this? Here we go. So this here, this is the little sort of uh, wrist strap. That's really cool because my current one hasn't got a wrist strap. It's also got this sort of lanyard, not lanyard. Uh, what are these called? I've forgotten what they're called already but this is the bit I'm interested in, is the extending arm. Here we go. It's one of those packagings that you just have to demolish. I'm so pleased with this. A big thank you to Xeries or whatever you're going to call them. Oh, here we go. Don't break it. Bit, bit more gentle. Bit more gentle. Don't get too excited. Here we go. This is it. Look at that. Love it. Absolutely love it. So this um, attaches to the bottom, if you so wish. Caribana. And then you can clip it onto a belt. And this is obviously the little lanyard or wrist strap, which you can attach on the bottom here. And then this... All oh, right, so this releases the ball head, so you can actually adjust it into different positions. It's quite a bit different to the one I've already got. And then that locks it into position like that. And then 
pull and turn right to unlock. Ah, ah ha, ha, ha. look at that. So we've got the extend the arm. So we can extend this out and hold the camera out in front of us and get some really cool shots. And I assume that when you turn it the other way, it locks in position. So that's locked in that position now. Very, very cool. Let's get the camera on this and I'll try it out. So there we go. It is now mounted on the new U-Shot. So this is a U-Shot from x -series. Now, uh, I just love it. This is at full extension. So full arm length and full extension from the U-Shot. And this is how far away I can get. I think it's brilliant. It feels very well balanced as well. And I like the fact it's got that ball head adjustment. This is my old one or the one I've been using up to now. And this was fine. It's sort of a, a little bit cheaper sort of materials and the head on the top wasn't adjustable in all directions. It would only tilt up and down. So you couldn't rotate the camera on the head. So I just think this one is a big step up in quality. Now I checked out the x website probably about a week or so ago, and there are loads of different versions of this. There's even like a, a deluxe leather version as well. And they're just well worth checking out. I would definitely check it out. So anyway, on with the rest of my day, which has been very, very eventful. I have been so full on working, but if you follow me on Twitter or Facebook, you will have seen that earlier in the day, I posted some very exciting news, and it's actually some job opportunities for app developers, of which I'm looking for two, possibly more, but two at the moment, and also a graphic designer. Now, I can't sort of give you full details of the business because some of it is very, very secret at the moment, but what I will say is it's very exciting and the business model I've been working on uh, for the new business launch is super cool. Very, very cool. Now, if you do fit into those categories and you want to check out what I posted on Facebook, either follow me on Twitter for regular updates or check the link in the video description where I will directly link you to that post. And if you do fit into those categories, please do get in touch. It's very, very exciting. And that leads me on to something else as well to do with the new business launch. I actually signed on the dotted line. So there is a new studio signed for, and I'm gonna start working on designing what's going in there over the next week or two. And then once that's actually in place, so once all the desking is in place, uh, the seating, computers, etc., then I will give you a little sneak peek at what we're doing down there as well. So. I am just so excited. It's a, a, a new uh, venture for me. Um, I envisage it being a very dynamic company and that's all I can say at the moment. But yeah, all smiles here. So there we go, that's been my day. Uh, I'm cooking as normal. Let me hear you say it. Come on, what am I cooking? Yes, it's been about a week I think, or has it? Am I addicted to spaghetti bolognese? I think I am. I do vary my diet, believe me, really I do. I've, I've had, uh, what did I have yesterday? I had that tortellini yesterday with the tuna bread. And then we had a chicken meal the day before. The day before that, I can't remember. So I think it's been at least four or five days since we've had spaghetti bolognese. So don't call me a spaghetti bolognese addict, addict just yet. Not quite yet. The rest of my day has been testing some products. I've also been really loving that Lumia 1020 in the camera grip case. When I reviewed the 1020, I loved it back then, awesome phone. There's a couple of the apps that were missing back then that are now available uh, on the Windows Phone platform, including my banking application and also Instagram, which is great to see those on the platform. And I'm just loving it. I'm really liking rediscovering the Lumia 1020 again. And this is my own personal phone this time. It's like a secondary phone to my iPhone 5S. So for me, the rest of my day is gonna be a little bit relaxing, just gonna watch some telly, eat dinner of course, and then relax for the rest of the evening because it's been very, very busy. I probably will do some emails later on as well, in all fairness. When you're self-employed, you try and stop work, but if I'm not doing anything, I would rather use that time uh, to my best ability. You know, I would rather not just sit here and watch telly when I'm not really interested in the programme. So if there's nothing on telly, sometimes I do pick up the laptop and just run through a few emails. I try not to do it too often because it's nice to actually just sit and chat to the family, you know, not have those distractions all the time. 
But super busy here. I hope your day has been good, but not hectic. I hope you've had a fantastic day, actually. The weather seems to be getting better as we're progressing towards spring and obviously into summer as well. So that's a good thing. So I hope you've all had a fantastic day. In fact, let me know in the comments section how your day was. I really am genuinely interested. And although lately, because I've been so busy and getting so many comments, I haven't answered all of them. I do read each and every one of them. So thanks again for watching. Hit that like button. I'll see you all in the next one. Thanks so much for watching the video. If you'd like to watch another amazing video from me, please do click that top box. And if you want to subscribe to my geeky channel, click the red box on the bottom of your screen now. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.